So I have this challenge over here. One type of tower, read instructions. So here are the instructions. So it's 40k cash, 46 to 65, and you're only allowed to go with one type of tower for each round. However, you also have to sell those towers after each round, and you're not allowed to use them again. So for example, if you use only Dart Monkeys this round, you're not allowed to use Dart Monkeys for the rest of the game. And you gotta find a combo that works. So that means it's probably gonna take a while to figure out. Because I have a feeling we're gonna run out of uh, good options if you don't think about it properly. Okay, so uh, first off is open the right hero. What do you think? I think you absolutely have to use Gwendolyn because she can pretty much solo rounds with her one ability, the fire. And that round is probably really early on, so... Let's see if we can beat 46 with only one fire over here. And then here it'll get two touches for each ceramic. No? Dang. Gwen really isn't enough. Maybe it's level 6 Gwen. It's pretty expensive, but I think we need damage on the hero. Strong. So level 6 Gwen. Yeah, guys. Level 6 Gwen does work. We did lose a few lives, but... Cool. 1 out of 20, so now we're down 1700. So basically the way to think about this challenge... Um, what's the most useless tower come Moabs? Like 50s, 60s? Because you want to use those towers up right now. Uh, I guess Darts are pretty weak, so we can try that. Sure, how's this? Crossbow, triple shot, triple shot, juggernaut, juggernaut. So let's see if these two jugs are enough for this round. If not, we'll drop something down here, which I will, because balloons, there's a lot of them. Let's drop a quick panic dart. Okay, fine. A little pricey, but that's it for darts. After this round, sell everything. 36.9, that's not too bad. We might want to get rid of Mortar because it's not that good versus Moabs compared to other towers. Well, two signals it is. To 0 2 3 in the first bend. And then this Mortar, we will target Heavy Shells. Gets every type of balloon, which we want. Sniper against Soul 54, 55, 57, 60, okay. I think Boat for 60 is really good, because it's cheap. So, here come Fortifieds, we gotta target these, we have to. Forget those reds and blues. Target that Mortar, those ceramics. Come on. Let's get here now. Come on. Yellows? No, 31. Damn. Do I take 31? I guess. Well, that's round 3 done. Have I chosen an Ice round yet? Oh fuck, you're right. I think we should be using... Ice, this round, for sure, because we can save glue for 59, which Ice is not good at, because camo leads. Let's try these towers. Two Icicles, one Ice Shards. I have no idea if this is gonna, like, combine well together. And we're still leaking zebra. Oh wait, no, no. Ice Shards did get the Zebras, come on. There's a lot on the way around, though. But good, wow. Ice Shards MVP, for sure. But there's a lot of Zebras here, no! Come on, bruh. That almost worked. I guess we can try different icicles placements, like here. Oh, that's gonna look a few. Here come zebras. Oh, we got them. Well, I'll take that. With open arms. So there is ice. Gone and done with. Good riddance. Alchemist went. Oh, you're right. Alchemist is really bad. We gotta use Cookie Monster, I think, now. This round's... Let's just start with the Minimalist Alchemist. So, uh, let's wait for this first guy. Use one, and then when it's off cooldown, use it again, and then that should be it. That should be history. So one, now. On strong. Back to first. Clean it up, please. Oh, it's pretty weak. Oh, shit. Ability. I'm not sure it's gonna last long enough. Oh, no, the cooldown is... Oh, the ability duration is long as hell. Well, that was pretty easy. Although we did lose a lot of money. Down to 35. Do I really want to use up my ninja this early? I mean, I guess the popping power is really low. We're just gonna miss the mob damage, but ah oh well. We'll try two cheap jutsus, that's it. Let's see if that works at all. Oh, pretty easily. Do I even need to spend this much? Here come rainbows. Uh, I probably do. Whatever. That was the easiest round ever. See you later, 52. 
has Ceramics, Rainbows, and Moabs. A really tough one. Super Monkey. I probably want to get rid of Super, don't I? Because it's really expensive. I think I want to try Dark Knights. There's Moabs. Oh, wait, no, that's too easy, isn't it? No, no, I should wait till the late 50s to use this, for sure. Uh, it could still be Super. I mean, I guess I just gotta spend less. I'm not sure there's enough Pierce, though, on a Supers here. But we'll see. This is pretty cheap in the grand scheme of things. So if I beat this, I'll take it. And all signs look towards me beating this. Right? Oh yeah. This should easily work. That's 52 over with. You know this round only has Camel Pinks and Moab, so Spike Factory would not get overwhelmed. Can I somehow survive with only one Spike Storm? Let's see. I don't think so. I'll need another Spike Factory, I think. That's three Moabs. Let's activate... now? How's the timing for that? Come on, Spikes. Don't disappear. You disappeared, didn't ya? I think I used it too early. Did I? How would an extra 1-1-0 do? Try. Oh, so that, we actually popped one mod really quickly. I'm not sure if that was a good idea, but let's use Spike Storm when they loop, like now. Yeah, there we go. So we eat up the Spike Storm spikes over here. And then that means this should be fine. Oh yeah, there's plenty spikes. Might have actually been a little overkill, but ah well. If we run out of money, then so be it. 54 might be Sniper. Because Ceramics and Mobs only. Like, we'll start with one Sniper. You see how it kills Ceramics really easily? Yeah, we'll probably need two Snipers. Let's see. One, two, three, four. No. This Sniper actually might solo. Just watch. Come on. One, two, three, four. Hell yeah. Cheapest round ever. We actually gained money on that round. Maybe tack for now is fine. I wonder if the Ring of Fire beats Ceramics on this map. And then we'll have like one Overdrive for, well, the Moab. And then yeah, I think save Boomer for 63. Because I was thinking about using it this round, but I guess maybe not. So, Ring of Fire. That's actually really close. Jeez. So don't know about this Moab. Fuck. Extra attack shooter. Fuck it, Overdrive. That might not have been necessary. Oh well. Again, I don't expect to beat this first try. 56? Let's use Submarine. Does Ballistic Missile do enough damage to the Moab? Either that or Air Burst. So it's unstrong. Should be targeting it. How much damage? 5? God damn, that's so little. That is so bad. Let's get Air Burst. Nice. Got a little far, but I'll take it. After this round, we are down to... 28. So we're losing like a couple hundred every round. We haven't used Heli yet, I just realized. But I don't want to go for the goddamn, uh... Razor Rotors. Or the Apache. It's so much money. We're fucked if we go Apache. Fuck. Or maybe a Razor and a Downdraft is good enough for this round. So I'm gonna buy one extra Quad Darts. We'll start small. Let's go. And that actually beats the Ceramics really nicely. So this should work. All we needed was the Quad Darts and their DPS. How much money do we have after this round? It is pretty pricey, the helis, but worth. Down to... Ah, oh shit, 27. Yeah, if we go any further lower, we can't buy the expertise. Like, for example... 476, oh no. If I want to use this guy, I gotta use it now. Uh, this spot misses though. Uh, no. <laughs> Let's try over here. I'll take 58 for this guy. Cool beans. So now we're gonna lose a lot of money. See, 21k, but yeah, I had to. I promised this run I would use glue, so I will. We might just need a 310, and then a glue striker for the camel leads. A 240. So, how do I time the ability? Because I don't think if we use the glue strike, these regrows are gonna regrow too much. So, I gotta wait for them to, like, you know, unregrow. So, we'll have this glue on last. Come on, get the regrows. The Rigo Greens and shit. So when the glue wears off in the last one, 
We gotta strike. Like, uh, now. Good. Back to first. Please work. Those Regos are pretty much done with. And then the camo leads? No! I just realized. Ah, uh, they only do four layers. No, two glue strikes. Let's glue hose again after all of them are on regrowed now. Actually, that's pretty bad timing, but ah uh, well. Uh, and again? Okay, 60. We obviously just, uh, fuck. <laughs> Minus two lives. Bolt pole is very cheap and affordable. Hell yeah. Hopefully we don't run out of money for, uh, the ground zero on 64. Unless maybe I... I ground zero 62. 61? I didn't use bomb yet. Oh no. 420 for sure. Maybe mauler? Or a recursive? Uh, mauler? Recursive impact. Yeah, money management looks really important come uh, these rounds. Anyways, this mauler's getting cock blocked. Uh, good shit. Good shit, man. Uh, do I need two maulers this round? There's no way in this case I can afford a, uh, a Ground Zero then. Oh my shit. Two Maulers this time. We just gotta pop those mobs a little bit faster. And then we're gonna micro our bomb. Depending on, you know, where the mobs are. So back to first. A lot of balloons. Ooh. Gotta catch those zebras. We actually are gonna leak a few regrows, that's fine. That should work though, looks good. Yes. 67. 13-8, fuck, no. No. Oh no, 74. Can I beat this round? GZ. I'm so screwed. Is there a way I can stall for every balloon to come out? That would be legendary if I could. I kind of have to at this point, if you, if you can't see. It actually might work. Wait, wait a minute, come on. GZ? Oh! So 64 is going to be tough. But, whatever. So, Tower's left. Boomer, Wizard, and Druid. We actually might do this first try. Maybe. Again. Uh, don't jinx it. So, what do I need on this round? Can I just go with the Morglaves? Here they come. A lot of yellows. Yeah, we'll need two. Definitely two. If I get range here... Ooh, that's so close. I'm not sure. Like, that's the best you can hope for. Come on. Please snipe it. Perfect. I know Wave 3 is tougher, so I'm a little scared. Okay, maybe not. There's a lot of yellows. Nope, that's fine. Nicely done. So how much money do I have on next round? Well, we're fucked. 11-9. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I can't afford Arcane, can I? If I can, GG. Oh, wait a minute. We're not screwed. I'm not sure if I should save Arcane for next round, though, because it's really good. For BPs. Which round is tougher, actually? This round or next round? If this round is hard with Arcane, I'm gonna save it for 65. Otherwise... Oh, this is easy. Nope, nope, nope. Let's use Druid. Too easy there. Do you guys want to see the dumbest strategy ever? We have... Six Jungle Druids. Can they one-shot all these Moab insides? Let's see. I believe it should pop them up pretty quickly. Well... Don't know about quickly, but... No, we can't have him target the other shitty balloons. Hold on. We gotta have him strong, yeah, strong. Mobs only. Well, that's not even close. Jungle Druids, the cooldowns, come on. They're not gonna pop. Well, we did get everything but fortifieds, man. We actually aren't too far off, guys. But sadly... There's just not enough pawn power. Not enough range. Oofity. Yeah, we might try ball lighting. That's gonna be all my cash, though. Because ball lighting does do a lot of damage to Moabs. But the main issue is the insides. Hence why Jungle Druid would be nice. We're just missing a little bit of cash. Ooh, that's not gonna work, is it? That will survive with... No, that's too many. Ball lighting can't work. So, five Jungle Druids. That should be enough one-shots. Now we need to spam 010s. Well, with one less Jungle Druid, you see that there's a lot of Rams leaking. Two Strays getting through. Nice. I don't want to relocate. Otherwise, we forfeit that. 
Well, we're not gonna kill the Moab, still. Okay, so that's four. Stop there. Now we spam the shit out of zero one zeros. Again, we also gotta make sure to pop a... Oh, they all popped at once, come on. Don't target the ceramics, don't pop them. Four left. Come on, Jungle Druids. Activate, yes. Please, guys. This could be it. No! Wait, that, we can survive, guys. 32, please. Shoot, you fucking midgets. What? Wow. I didn't want to overspend, that's why I didn't panic sell, guys. I didn't want to panic sell, because I would have spent too much money. But, remember that. Four jungles, and those guys. Okay, we can do this. Wait a minute, okay. Should I drop a druid up here, guys? I think I should. Yes. So that will barely clutch it, my god. Should I overspend, guys? I'm not sure. Slowly. Two left. One left. Please. Timing. Wow. That was 0.2 seconds. Those vines are at reds. You know, I generally want to try the same strategy again. Fuck it. We're going to do the same thing, but save money, because that... Those towers on those rounds could absolutely work. There are a lot of rounds where we overspent. Like Tack, Spactory, Ninja. So this round was a big mistake. I bought an extra overdrive, like, all the way. So maybe this time I get, like, an overdrive and a sprayer, that's it. So no overdrive. 2k saved, if I don't get this. Just gotta pop this guy, and then some. Please, okay, that looks okay. Come on. Yes. Wow, that was really easy. Easy money saved. Maybe if I have my balloon impact here. Maybe a model with frags. Let's go. So we are gonna save on an entire mauler, which is like 2,000. Impact back and close. We got three mobs left. Don't leak anything, that's fine. We can leak those uh yellows and blues. As long as it's not like 10,000 yellows on top of each other. 63. Let's go. 2,000 save. That is amazing. SMH, man. SMH. Here we go. 2,000 in savings. Yeah, the 2k is enough for one extra jungle druid and some more. Here we go again. Four mobs here. If I can, I can drop an extra druid. But I really don't want to. Come on. Please pop one. Um, how about this one? Please. Yup, that's it. Oh boy. There you go, guys. $2,000 made it that much easier to beat the round. Now we have 10.987. Please, can I afford Arcane? Oh boy, 112. That's as close as you can get. So, that should beat Zebras and Rainbows easily. And then Ceramics. We'll drop a Wallfire when the time comes. Wait a minute. Wallfire now. Just in time. And then Arcane clean it up pretty nicely. This is it, boys. If the mobs get further, I'm gonna sell this one, buy a new one, etc, etc, and then win. It's that easy, guys. It is that easy. Like this. We can even drop another wallfire. Buy and resell, guys. That's the name of the game. First try, I told ya. 65 easy with wizards. And my god. <laughs> Three hours in. One type of tower challenge is complete. We actually did have a working strategy the first time. I just got a little greedy. But nonetheless, cool challenge.